Okay, there it is in all its splendor. Behold the Bullet 287 QB. It's a 2022 model. This is an exciting floor plan. I'm excited to show it to you. You see it's got two air conditioners up on the roof. You can see that edge of that solar panel up there also. So it is state of the art. It's got a solar charge controller. This one has a power tongue jack, power leveling uh, uh, stabilizers on each corner. Uh, it's a, it is uh, a 2022 ahead of its time. And look at that, it's got stereo speakers, a big awning, solid steps that make contact with the ground, a nice grab handle there. It's got an outdoor kitchen, a little fridge right here, and a two burner cooktop. Let the good times roll, baby. You'll be hanging out here at the campground, wherever you wanna go, do some tailgating, make you some jalapeno poppers, whatever you wanna do. You're gonna have a good time. Cook breakfast, there is a uh, prep for a rear camera. Ladder in the back with the walkable roof. We're fixing to go inside. I just want to show you the outside real quick. Big slide here. It's got a uh, dinette and a sofa that makes into a bed on it. And then there is a big pass-through storage right here. We'll take a peek at that. Lots of storage space there. There's your solar charge controller, your convenience center with your hot and cold shower. All right, let's go ahead and go on inside. Quit fooling around. I'm going to get my act together here. Solar Flex 200, that's a solar charge controller, a solar panel, and also an app you can download onto your phone. Keep an eye on it. Look at that nice furniture. That's Thomas Paine Collection. That is a very comfortable sofa. Makes into a bed. That dinette makes into a bed. Check out this kitchen. It's got the uh, subway tile motif black splash. Look at this uh, little sink cover here that you can rinse off some letters, dry some pots and pans. You even have access over here right when you walk in. There is, see that Pex plumbing? Good down to negative 10 degrees for it'll burst. And check out this cooktop. It's amazing. It's got my phone number on it. That's my cell number. You can send me a text. I will be happy to help you. Got a cooktop oven, nice size fridge. Let's take a look at this bunk room. That's what I was talking about. Now you have, that's a closet rod right there. So you can put those shelves down lower, adjust them to hold hanging items here for the occupants occupants of your bunk room so you've got a bunk here here and here then this makes into a bunk so this this comes up and you've so you can latch these latch it up and then you've got a place for uh just a separate dinette for your kids or friends family to hang out get away get a little space just a nice place to hang out and there's a tv backer location in here lots of storage here for the stuff you got occupants you need to match there's a place to hang up some stuff you could bring your adult relatives your friends that don't like to pay rent they're always around hey check it out you got a bathtub and give your dog a bath you can take a luxury shower shower here in the skylight nice uh medicine cabinet i guess i should have turned on this light here for the uh bathroom demonstration there we go i'm, I'm waking up all right, I'm going to try to maintain my composure here. you got a nice shelf there in storage underneath there. Look at that toilet. Plenty of space all the way around it. Okay, we covered the bathroom. That's a bathroom, folks. Got the microwave. Take another look. That TV swings out on an arm right there. See that radius roof? It, it opens it up. This is a nice floor plan. Lots of storage down there. Place to put some spices. So you have two doors. So what they did on this bedroom... When you have a bunk room and a living room, you want to have a lot of living room space. Well, they want people to get on the bed from either side in comfort. So where you're giving up a little bit of space is right here. It's up against this wall because they wanted to move this wall this way so you have more space in here for everybody to hang out. But you still have a place you could just walk up here on either side and get on the bed because you have an entrance from each side. And then there's a wardrobe on each side with a place to hang stuff up, a place there, put your uh, stuff when you're sleeping. You've got a uh, USB and 110 on each side of the bed. So this is a very functional floor plan. It's, uh, it holds a lot of people and it's comfortable, roomy, and fairly lightweight. You could tow it with a lot of half-ton trucks with no problem. Hey, my name is Duke, and here is my cell phone number. 
and send me a text I'll be happy to help you just click on my channel subscribe look at all my videos if there's something else you want to see let me know what's what will work for you what's your situation how many occupants how many people are going to go what you're going to use it for where you're going to stay and I will be happy to find a rig that matches what you're looking for at least my suggestion let me know what kind of truck you got whatever you got I'll be happy to work with you show how easy it could be to purchase an RV with no dealer prep fees no extra charges no freight stuck in there no tricks we got a campground here you can stay in our campground and uh, check it out for a couple days before you leave I'll be your host. I'm your video host right now, but I'll be your host in person and make it a great purchase experience for you. It's important. You want it to start out good and have a great experience all the way through in the RV lifestyle. Hey, thank you very much.